Yo, what is happening everyone? It's JDog3015 here, back with another Skate 3 video. In today's video, I got another banger of a game save. Now, if you guys enjoy my weekly content and want to see more, feel free to hit that like button and subscribe for more future videos. But without further ado, let's get right on to this game save. Every game save comes with all the Dr. Pepper stuff, including the two shirts and the hat and the Dr. Pepper can man. It also comes with this sick looking Batman board as well. Alrighty, now let's take a closer look at this new skater. As you guys can see here, we got the glowing purple hoodie skater that has, as we zoom in here, the Batman hat with the glowing purple hoodie with the monster logo on the back. And going around to the skater on the front, we also have red hands and the red robot glasses from the demo. There's also custom black pants as well. Now for the board, we got the Rasta board, which is sick. This board comes also with custom black realistic grip tape. Alrighty, so that's basically it for the skater. And if you guys do not know how to get this game save on your Xbox 360, stick around later for a full tutorial on how to do that. Alrighty, so we're going to go to edit skaters and swap genders here to the male. As you guys can see, it's the exact same thing, but on the male. So if you guys like that, that's on the game save as well. I'm curious, what do you guys rate this skater at a 10? Is it a 10 out of 10, 4 out of 10, or 5 out of 10? Comment down below. And now if we go to free play, like I said at the beginning of the video, this ape comes with all the Dr. Pepper stuff, including the Dr. Pepper can man. Now, if you guys have watched and know how to get this a game save on your Xbox 360 and want to know any other game saves of mine that I've made videos on, I'll leave something in the top right corner for you guys to check out. Okay, so let's take a look at these logos on this game save. For the first logo is the purple monster logo. The second logo is the Batman logo. And for the third logo we have is of course the black box. Then finally for the last logo we have a Rasta logo with the green, the red and the yellow. Now right here if you guys go to number 2, I'm going to show you guys how to recreate that Batman board. It's pretty easy, you just got to make it a little bit big and then there you have it. Okay, so last week I posted a poll for you guys, girl or guy for the next import, which is this import, and 56% of you guys voted for guy. So this week it's going to be a guy. And like always, after every video I have uploaded, I try to post another poll for you guys to vote on for next week's skater. That being said, if you guys add me right now at import dog, I'll add you back and you can get this sick looking purple glowing hoodie skater with the monster on the back. That is once again import dog and keep in mind all my imports are exclusive meaning I only do this up to 100 friends on Xbox 360 or for one week. So if you guys are viewing this a week later the video has been uploaded I probably came up with a new video and a new skater so keep your eyes out for that and if you try to add me and my friends list is full that's probably because I reached the maximum of friends on Xbox 360 which is 100 friends. But don't worry about that 100 friends thing because every time I reach 100 friends, the next following week I delete everyone so everyone has a good chance to get these imports. And if you guys missed the import itself and want to get the game save with the black box, the two characters and the Dr. Pepper stuff, I always share that as well. It's in the description down below. Speaking about game saves, if you do not know how to get this game save on your Xbox 360, that tutorial is coming up right now. Just before we get into this, all the download links are in the description for Horizon and the game save itself. So before you guys do anything else, just download those links. Alright, so if you guys are doing this for the first time ever, go onto your 360, start up Escape 3, and you want to make a brand new uh, game save that has like nothing on it. This is a good way to ensure that nothing would go wrong. 
um, if you're doing it from scratch, but if you already have a game save, that's okay too. Now, on your 360, you want to grab your USB stick and plug that bad boy in. And then select USB storage and then make a new game on it. I'll speed up this process so you don't have to really uh, see it all. Alrighty, so once you're set up, you want to go to edit skaters and then edit skater. Now you just want to change like one little thing and then back out so it saves. I'm just going to put this uh, a little graphic on there just to ensure that it's something different. So yeah, you want to have that little icon right there. It's just a saving icon. And once you get that, you can back out. I'm just going to show you guys that there's no graphics on this. Awesome. Once it's saved, you can just back out of your Xbox 360 and then you can go into your computer. Remember to unplug your USB from your Xbox 360 because you'll need that later. Now on Horizon, you got to grab that USB and then plug it into your PC. Once your USB is in your PC, you want to start up Horizon. Once you're in uh, Horizon, you want to go to your USB storage device, you want to go to Games, you want to go to Escape 3, and then you want to go to your profile. Sometimes your profile says unknown, but then you got to check what date has been modified, basically the day that you created it. So we pulled it out, and go to Contents, go to Skater P, and then go to Replace. Now when you want to place it with the skater.p that you downloaded before, and the same thing for the RMC DEL as well. After you do that, you want to save, rehash, and resign, and then that's it. Make sure you uh, remove your USB, and then you can go on to your 360. Once again, the download for the game save will be in the description down below. Now, on your Xbox 360, all you have to do is plug in your USB into your 360. Then you want to go ahead and start up Skate 3. Now, like before, when you press Start and A, you want to select your USB storage. And make sure right here you do not connect to EA Nation, or else you lose your black box and graphics. It's very important. Remember, we went from basically having one skater and nothing to having all five skaters, and you can see in the top left there's a black box. Now, I'm going to show you guys that we do have graphics the one, two, three, four right here. Remember, before we didn't have any at all, so I'm just going to put the black box on the board right now. Yeah, and that's pretty much it. Um, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys liked the video. And I uh, hope you guys like and subscribe. And I'll catch you later.